Yeah, what? I told you. Oh, if I squeal here, I'm going to slam them. <laughs> <laughs> Good, force one, force the cost. Yeah. Oh. Squid. Remember my lamb, my lamb is Bashi. You are slim by me. Yes. Yes, I hold them. They need to remember my lamb. Because it's quite dangerous for them. That's a lamb. You have to feel the squid bite. Yeah. Wait to sink? Let it sink slowly. You will feel your jig, the weight change. And by that time, you pull. Yeah. Hi guys, good evening. Bash here. Today I'm at the Adams Public Fishing Pier. Targeting for the squid now is uh, today is the uh, September 15th, which is quite earlier for squid. Most of squid now is still small size of summer squid, but uh, I heard some of my friends came here Monday get uh, quite a good size of uh, squid and uh, get a few pounds. And actually, five weeks ago at here. I get about a three and a half pound too. That's why I came here to have a try. Hopefully we can get some squid. And let me show you guys my gears. So uh, here is my lightweight Okuma rod, spinning rod, 3,000 reel. This is my eight pound of line. Over there, I have a two squid jig. Um, this is a typical uh, high, low, Squid jig. That's one on the bottom. It's a <coughs> bottom squid jig, which is a one third ounce. Over there, the double hook is one fifth ounce. That's top jig. I use there one. Usually, I use two different colors. Over there, I use pink and green. So let's go there, cast out, and see our luck today. I think I get a big one. Oh, it's double. Ooh, double. yes, double. double. How's yes. Are they at the bottom? Quite at the yeah. bottom. Quite at the bottom? Yes. Pick his arm. What's a little bit deeper in the bottom. You don't know my bottom. It's just like cast out and to the top. Is it still or not? No. Yeah, let it sink. Let it sink a little bit. You will feel the bite. When they bite, they will push your jig, a lot of pull it down. So you will feel your jig be, become lighter. At that time, you pull. So that's always how squid bite. Well. A few, few, a few minutes, no squared, just recast, you'll find them. Oh, that's a test. Yeah, I can feel it. Shit, yeah, you have to feel them. Hey, the YouTuber doing all the stuff. Yeah, what is, what is it? <laughs> you have to feel it, really to feel the bite. So let it sink slowly. You will feel them. They are just like push your jig. Yeah. You see, I control how my jig sink slowly, like control it. Oh. You oh, got you it. Go on, you go on, you go on. Oh, yeah. you're right. It worked. Yeah. Control it. Control the speed of this thing. Five seconds. Yeah. <laughs> you have to really to feel the bite. That's a trick. That's a key point of squid fishing. Yeah. 
so you learned as a trick, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, I feel it. There's met a lot of them down there. Yeah, you can feel them grab it. Yeah. Yeah, that's the most important thing of the squid fishing. You have to really feel the bite. Yeah. If you can feel it, you are almost there. And don't don't jig too frequently. Like this squid, they were watch and then, then bite they are smart yeah. they are very smart yes got it. i got it so you just let them bite on it <laughs> you feel it right let them bite on it don't jig too frequently because you will be scared like if there are a lot of many of them yeah. you jig a lot because you want to attract them here yeah. but if you know they're down there don't need that many that much jigging yeah i can feel them i think this is a bigger one yes this is a bigger one yeah beautiful Yeah, wait for them to bite. You see, I don't jig at all. And they are like coming to my jig. <laughs> oh. There's a lot of them down there right now. I can feel the bite. Once you feel them, you are very close to a master of a squid fishing I don't think I'll get close to you in a few years yeah yeah that's how that's I feel them too. yeah there he is yeah yeah they are coming to my jig <laughs> what's our herring <laughs> Yeah, I swear I can feel the bite. Yes, that's it. Are you ready? Are you ready for the combo? Mm. Yeah, to here and to the bottom. Oh. Wait for the fishing tip to move. Yeah, that's the trick. Once it's moved, the squid is here. <sighs> we are the master. Yeah, wait for the fishing pole to move. I can feel it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, once you can feel it, you are good. <sighs> oh, I miss a bite. Yes, you are miss once, not going to be twice. Okay, I'm going to set up my light. Uh, oh, you need a squid. Yeah. What? Oh, I'll get it for him. Yes, 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 you remember my limb.
Yes. Look at this one back. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Beautiful. Because the squid is too small, I don't really feel the bite. It's just like fishing rod, the tip or bounce. That's how I can tell the squid is there. Another bite, another bite. I'll get you hooked. Yeah? Yeah, it's still testing the bait. Oh! Yeah, test, test, that's dangerous. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, they're definitely here. Just a very small squid, and the bite is so tiny. You need to be really focused on it and see that tiny bounce of your fishing tip your fishing rod tip and then pull them out that's how you get the work done squared Yes. Yes. Top jig. Huh? Hi guys. It's about uh, 11:30 maybe. I'm ready to heading home. This is where I got um, about 70 of them. Probably four pounds. They are so small. You can see some are squid. So small. At this early season, this is not bad at all. About 70 of them, four pounds. Yeah, hope you guys liked this video. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time. Bye bye.